Hello everybody and welcome back to another Good Games Car Break video. My name is Matt and in this tutorial we're going to go over our brand new website here at goodgamescarbreaks.com. We're going to go over the login, rewards, how to make a best offer on individual cards, our menu navigation, advanced search filters, and the charity page. So to get us started here we are again at the homepage of goodgamescarbreaks.com. And we can navigate to our account right up here on the menu bar, my account, or on the right side here, my account as well. So we click on that. You're going to see new customers can create a brand new account here, or you can log in if you're a returning customer. What's important here is if you had a previous account with us on our old website, all you have to do is reset your password. Or that email address you use for your old account because we did migrate all of them over so we'll go ahead and pause this video to log in and we'll come back all right folks welcome back we just signed into our account and this is the page that you will see displayed it'll show you your billing information and your shipping address any saved credit cards that you might have you can also add new ones uh, your address books, if you have more than one address that you want to ship to or uh, get billed to, you can add those here. Your rewards, this is important here. We do still offer reward points, and you can also uh, redeem them down here in the bottom left corner. That'll display uh, the rewards little sub uh, pop-up menu here. Display how many rewards you have. View your reward points. How to earn more points. If you click on that, it'll even show a referral link that you can utilize to earn uh, more reward points. If you click on View Details, it's actually going to show you when you earn those reward points, how many points you earned, and any notes. Uh, or references for why you earn those reward points like purchasing an order um, maybe you got a bonus for a giveaway something of that nature and of course uh, how many total points were available in your account and you can also redeem those points so before we redeem them we'll st show you one other thing store credits this is important if you ever have an issue with an order and want to uh, get a refund instead of getting a full refund back to your credit card you can pick a, the option of getting store credit and that will apply right here uh, something important to note is that those store credits will automatically apply to your next online purchase at checkout so you won't have to do anything as far as uh, applying a code or anything of that nature so let's dive into the rewards store here we want to redeem our reward points we got over 5,000 let's go ahead and redeem them here so it's going to take you to the reward store which is also right here on our website menu navigation we offer um, some products so sealed wax value packs uh, slabs single cars etc we'll keep adding to the reward store over time but what's important and very cool about this is when you're signed into your account, you can click on one of these reward prizes here and you'll see a price that is available for you. If you want to use your normal payment method, you certainly can to uh, purchase any of the items in the reward store. But let's say you want to use your reward points. You have enough to redeem this item. You can certainly do that by clicking on this button and it'll subtract the reward points from your account and zero out this item into your cart so all you would have to do is pay for shipping so it's a nice way of us saying thank you for supporting good games card breaks and we hope we can continue adding some fire to your personal collections so let's go to the menu navigation real fast as well so right up here we got your home page you can also click our good games card breaks icon to take you back to the home page you see our buy merch little sub menu navigation here as well as on our home page carousel that'll open up a new uh, window tab to 
check out all of our merch. We've got t-shirts, hoodies, long sleeve crew necks, and some tank tops for the summertime. We're always adding new merch and designs to that store, so feel free to check it out. It is a lot of awesome uh, designs and options there for you guys. We certainly do appreciate the support. Next to that is our WhatNot app link. So if you never joined WhatNot yet, you're a first time customer, you can click on that link and it'll give you our referral link, which will allow you to earn $10 in store credit that you can apply to any, any breaker on the WhatNot app to get you started on adding some more fire to your collection. Next to that is our watch live tab. That's going to take you directly to our YouTube uh, profile. So whenever we do mixer breaks or personal breaks, giveaways, things of that nature, this will take you right to that live link. Our rewards program. This is also nice to check out. It'll show you all the instructions on how to uh, set up an account for the rewards program. How, how many points you can earn and how you can earn those points, how to spend them like we just went over with the reward store, um, how do I sign up, how long do those rewards last, and so forth. So everything is labeled and highlighted here. Again, reward points will last up to 365 days, and you will be notified 60 days prior to any unused reward points that will expire. Also, anything in the reward store uh, will not earn you any reward points when you purchase those and if it's a sealed wax product It will be shipped to you sealed so you can enjoy ripping it um, at your house with your loved ones, etc So let's move on to best offer and how to run the search filter so if you you're on a desktop computer or your mobile phone You will still see this search box right up here in the top right corner we do have some default uh, pre-existing search filters that we've been uh, working with that you'll see here. But let's say we want to look up baseball cards. It's going to give us a bunch of search results here. You're going to see some wax. You're going to see some individual cards all over the place here, different price points, etc. So what does the advanced search filter do for us? It's going to allow you to narrow down your search filter based off of price points or even the category. So if we're looking strictly for just baseball cards, we can click on this category right here that's telling us there's 20 search results for just baseball cards. So we're seeing all sorts of stuff here. We've got some magged case hits. We've got some nice Veteran autos of Fernando Tatis Jr., some RPAs, we've got some relics, rookie cards, etc. So let's go ahead and click on this Fernando Tatis Jr. card because I'm interested. I like Fernando Tatis and it's always tough to pull his autograph. So what's nice is all the images we provide front and back of the cards. All you have to do is hover over the image or double click it and it will allow you to get a closer image of the card itself, which is always convenient if you're looking to grade some raw cards. But what's important here is this make an offer button. If you're logged into your account, you'll be able to click on this make an offer and it'll actually allow you to submit an offer. Cause let's say 225 is a little bit out of your price range. You wanna try and get a steal on a deal here. You can submit an offer price with your name and email address and any comments or notes that you want to make. And we'll get an email notification for that best offer. And we will go ahead, review it and reach back out to you, either accepting it, countering with us another offer or declining it with some comments. We can also reach out to you via email. So that's why it's important to put your email there for us. And if you ever have any questions on how to submit an offer or what you need to do in order to make an offer, just go down to our product details right here. And it'll tell you that you must be logged into your account to submit an offer. You can also click on that uh, phrase right there because that has an embedded link to the My Account uh, registration that we showed previously. 
And we always say, please review all images for exact card condition. And we try to give you some brief synopsis on the player of the card. Um, if it's serial numbered, the overall condition, et cetera, et cetera. And it'll display, if you scroll down a little bit further, the reward points that you'll earn with this purchase, any related items that you may want to add to your cart, and so forth. So one last thing we want to show you guys, we'll go back to the menu item here, is the charitable donation. We've been supporting uh, Operation Pause for Homes here it is an animal rescue uh, foundation shelter. We've been supporting them for several years now. They rescue animals, so dogs, cats from all over the country. Sometimes they go international and rescue some uh, dogs and cats. And we really like their, their concept, their ideology. They are a no-kill shelter. They do intensive background checks to make sure that you are the right fit for that animal so that they can find their forever home. So if you've got a good heart and you like giving back, you can go ahead and click on Operation Pause for Homes on our homepage carousel. Or you can go to the search box here and type in donation or charity. And it'll pop up right there. You can click on it and it'll take you to the same product listing. All you have to do to donate is click the sub menu drop down bar here and you can donate anywhere from a dollar to a hundred bucks. If you want to do thirty dollars, you can uh, add ten dollars to your cart. It'll pop up with this little sub cart menu here. You can say I want to continue shopping. And then come back and add $20, and that'll give you a total of $30 to donate to Operation Pause for Home. So it's just like a normal product listing. And we've got one other feature here that you can also go to navigate for uh, adding a charitable donation. Let's say you purchased uh, a card or a sealed product etc you can go ahead on the checkout screen this is the shopping cart the next page will be the uh, checkout menu so once you get all your information in here it's asking is this the address we want to play with it it is it's our test address and we're going to go ahead and show you all your shipping methods uh, the options that you can select for it and we always make the charitable donations free shipping. So if you're just donating, it'll be free. Put in your card method or your PayPal. But right down here at the bottom, additional options. You can go ahead and donate an additional one to five uh, or even $10 max from this screen. So let's say you want to add another $10. We'll just click off of that and it should update for us. Right there, additional options, $10. So we got your $30 donation. We have your additional 10 to give us a total of $40 being uh, donated in this example. So that is how you can donate to Operation Pause for Homes. And we always appreciate it when you do. All donations will be uh, donated to Operation Pause for Homes. We do not keep any of the money that you donate. So everything goes to Operation Pause for Homes. Feel free to follow them on Instagram or check out their uh, website. You can certainly do that in our product details right here. Learn more about OPH here. And they'll uh, give you their background, their synopsis, all that good stuff. So thank you so much for tuning in and checking out our brand new website. Feel free to drop some comments. Let us know if you got any questions, which was your favorite part about our new website and those features. And we'll see you guys in the next one.